Da 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 da. Oh, blab. Welcome back into my space. This is where I do my science because anywhere that I am doing science is my hub lab space because anywhere you want to do science in the big wide world is your lab. The world is the biggest lab out there. Research has been going for years. Have a go. Today, we are welcoming you back to the wonderful world of water and what goes in it. Uh, we had a question sent in to us is how do submarines work? How do they stay underwater and how do they come up to the top? So we're going to talk a little bit about that, but then how we can build our own little model submarine. I know, we will all live in a model submarine. I have a bowl of water and I'm going to bowl you over with some science. Uh, we have uh, a few bits and pieces that you might need to make your own submarine this time. You need a bottle, you'll need some tubing, uh, some weights, so I'm going to use coins, some tape and a container of water to put into and something to make holes into this. But we'll talk about that in a second. First bit is, is about why things float and why things sink. Now, something that we've talked a little bit about before. Now, if I put this bottle inside in here, it floats and it floats up really high in the water because it's really quite light in comparison to the size of the object. So the bottle is this size, but the inside of it, there's a lot of space just filled with air. However, if we take out this and let's say fill half of it up, fill up, yeah. Fill? No, okay. If I fill, of science, hey, this amount of water, as you'll see that this space is no longer taken up with air, it's taken up with water. So if I put it in here now, doesn't float as much, it kind of sinks down a little bit more. Or if we fill it completely, blah, 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 beautiful sound there, completely with water, there's only a tiny little bit of an air gap at the top here. And now I put it in, See how low it sits in comparison? There's a little tiny bit of the air, so that's why it's popping up at the top. It's a little bit dense. So how do we make or use this into a submarine? Because if something, we want something to sink, we can't just fill it with water and then fill it with air, can we? Well, yeah, we can. That's exactly how submarines work. So submarines have compressed air in cylinders inside them. So what they use is they use that air to push and pump the water out so that they lower their density and they rise up to the top. We don't have cylinders of water, but we do have some tubing and we are going to try and make our own model of a submarine. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a scissors. I'm going to be careful with this. And I'm going to, you're going to put a hole in the very top. So get a responsible adult to help you with this. Not just any adult, a responsible adult. And we're true here. Yeah, perfect. So I've got our own little hole in here now. And now I'm going to try. Again, this is the bit where it's a little bit more dangerous just is to make a mark here and then try and push this through so that you'll be able to get a hole and so you put it through like that spin it round and you've got your own little hole underneath number one and i'm going to put another one here do, 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 nice and gently scratch it first and there we go it pops in turn it round Close the scissors, don't run with them, put it back here. So now we have three holes, number one, number two, and number three. So we're gonna put them down like that. Next, we're gonna do what we said, which is add the weights. So I'm gonna use that, like I said, the coin. So I have some tape, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the tape flat on the table here, and I'm gonna take two 50 cent pieces, and I'm gonna put them here and here, stick, and then I have another two 50 cent pieces, and I'm gonna put another piece of tape here and here. Okay, so then I put another 50 cent piece in the middle and in the middle. And then I'm going to put the, now I'm making sure that I don't put these over the holes. So I put that, that one can go there. So there we put that in here, put that tape there, close up that bit, put that tape there and there. Ah, okay. So yes, you see on the other side, you can see clear through the bottle that we've got tape, coins and coins. And if we were to put this in, it would sit there and just kind of bob. So what we're going to do is we're going to put our tube in there like that. Now we have this. So if I put this in the water, mm -hmm, and I put it in. So you see when I put it in here, it floats on the top. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to use this tube to suck the air out, which is the same on a normal submarine would be when they let the water into the ballast tanks. So if I suck the air out, create space for the water to go in. It starts to sink. So what I've done is I've sucked the air out, I've let the water in, so I've made it more dense, so the bottle sinks. 
the tube, like you don't have a tube on a big submarine out into like the base or the, the port or wherever you are going exploring, looking in the seabed. You have those compressed air tanks. And what they use is they let the ballast in and then they use the compressed air to push or pump the water back out. So I'm going to act as that cylinder now and I'm going to pump air back inside it and make the bottle less dense again. Ready? <gasps> Okay, so I got some. That is not tasty water. Where do we get that from? You don't know. You don't know where. You, this is random water. Oh, okay. Thank you. So yes, now this end is too. Okay. Look, you can see my design isn't going the best. But what you would have to do is balance. So earlier on, it was too much like that. Then I put two on. Then it's too long. So send us in your attempts at this. rte.ie forward slash learn. I'd love to see your designs. Could you make this look cooler? Could you get the balance right? Try your tubing. What am I doing that you could make better? Just because I'm here showing you this doesn't mean that I'm the master of it. You could have a better idea. Imagine what you'd be like and standing up there as the captain of an engineer of a submarine. Have a go, build it yourself and see how you get on. It's all about trying things from something really simple to something really complex. It's all about having a go and seeing how you can make things better. Try it yourself. See you soon.